Hello and welcome to Pabli. So Pabli Connect has recently launched its integration with Odoo. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can set up Odoo Webhook based trigger inside your Pabli Connect workflow. So here you can see I've created an automation workflow inside Pabli Connect. Now we will start with the trigger step and here in choose app, we will search for Odoo. Just select it. After selecting Odoo, here in trigger event from the dropdown, select the trigger event as configure webhook. After selecting this trigger event, Pabli Connect give us a webhook URL. And now we have to add this webhook URL in our Odoo app and we have to configure this webhook to receive the responses from Odoo inside Pabli Connect. Now you must be thinking how we are going to add this webhook URL. So for that, you just have to follow the instructions given below over here. Just copy the webhook URL from here and then just go to your Odoo account. So this is my Odoo account and here you have to select the app. You have to open the app for which you want to set up this webhook. Let's say I want to set up this webhook for contacts. So I will be selecting contacts over here. After selecting contacts, here you can see on the right top corner, you can see this option to toggle studio. So we have to select this option and then you will be toggled to Odoo Studio section. So here you can see as I click on it, the Odoo Studio will be toggled over here. And here we are. After coming here, you can see this option of automations. Just click on it. After coming to automations, just click on this new button. And as we click on new, here we have to enter the name of this automation. Let's say I'll name it as Pabli Trigger. You can basically give any other name of your choice. Then it is asking us for the trigger. And here in this drop down, you can see a list of different options that on happening of what event we want to send the data from Odo contacts to Pabli Connect. Let's say I want to set up the trigger as on save. And after selecting the trigger here, it is asking us when updating. So here in apply on, we have selected all the records and under updating, let's say I want that whenever a new contact name is saved, a new contact is created in Odo, I want to receive the response inside Pabli Connect. So I'll just search for name over here. And let's say I will be selecting this trigger as contact name. So we are basically setting up the trigger that whenever the name of the contact is added or updated or saved, Odo is going to send the response and the details to Pabli Connect. Now we have basically created this trigger, but on happening of this event, what we want to do, we want to send the webhook response to Pabli Connect. So for that, just click on this add an action button below that. And after that, here just select this option of send webhook notification. After selecting this option, it is asking us for the URL. And here we have to enter the exact same webhook URL which Pabli Connect gave us. Just copy it from here and then paste it over here. After pasting the webhook URL, here it is asking us for the fields. That what are the fields? What are the details of this event you want to receive inside Pabli Connect? Let's say I want to receive the details like name. So I will be selecting name over here. Then I want to receive the email address of this contact as well. So I'm selecting email. Then I want to receive the mobile number. So let me search for mobile number. Then for example, I want to receive the address. So I'll be searching for address, complete address contact and select it. So in this way here, you can see from this drop down, you can see a list of different fields and whatever fields you want to receive inside Pabli Connect, you can select any fields from here of your choice. Let's say I want to receive the company name, company ID, credit, debit. So here you can see a list of a number of fields. So you can basically select any field which you want to receive inside Pabli Connect. For now, I've just selected some basic fields over here. After selecting these fields, just click on this save and close button. And after setting up this action, just save this automation over here. Just click on this save button and we are done. We have successfully created this automation that whenever a new contact name will be saved in our Odo contact, automatically those details will be sent to the webhook to Pabli Connect. Now after saving this automation, just close this Odo Studio. And after that, in Odo contact, we are going to create, we are going to save a new contact. I will just click on this new button and let's say I want to enter the name of this person as test dummy. This is the name of this contact. Let's say the address is A101. Then the street is New Street. The city is, for example, Bhopal. The state is Madhya Pradesh. And this is the zip code. After that, let me enter a mobile number over here. So this is a dummy mobile number which we are entering. 
and then this is the email address. And after entering these details of a new contact, we will just click on this save button. Now, as we click on save here, you can see just now we have created a new contact in Odo contact and we will see within seconds automatically in our public connect workflow here, you can see we have received the response. And in this response, you can see the details of that exact same contact. We have the same name test dummy. We have the same mobile number. We have the ID of the contact. We have the same email address. And also we have the same address over here. So whatever fields we have selected while setting up the automation, while setting up the action in our Odo Studio, you can see all of those fields, details of all of those fields are received inside Pabli Connect. Now, if you want to receive some other details other than that, then while setting up the automation, while setting up the action, you have to select those fields and you will get those details in your Pabli Connect workflow. So in this way, you can set up the webhook trigger of Odo inside Pabli Connect and start automating your Odo related tasks. So I hope this video was helpful to you. If you liked the video, don't forget to hit the like button. And if you have any doubts or queries, write us in the comment box below. So this is it for today's video. Thank you. Have a great day.